Flate and the Manufacturers Association of Florida present Made in Florida. Every day, you enjoy things you may not realize were made in Florida. Behind every product and technology you use, there is a world of manufacturing. Today, more than 16,000 different companies and 400,000 Floridians work in the manufacturing field. This means that not just jobs, but manufacturing careers are being made in Florida by people like you right now. If you get satisfaction by making something, get excited about using new technology, or you work well with teams of people, then the manufacturing industry may be the place for you with a challenging job great pay and excellent benefits. Now we're going to show you that more than just fruit and fun is made in Florida. First let's take a look at what manufacturing in Florida is. Depending on the type of process being used or the type of product that is being made, Florida's diverse manufacturing industry can be grouped into many smaller sectors. Today, we're going to take a closer look at Florida companies that manufacture products in the following sectors. Medical devices and instruments, food, beverages, and pharmaceuticals, electronics and technical instruments, metals and plastics fabrication. Now let's go inside the facilities and meet the real people that wear the safety and personal protective gear and make the products that we use every day. food, beverages, and pharmaceuticals. When you think of the food industry in Florida, you may think of cows and orange trees. But behind these natural resources is a huge industry of companies and people throughout Florida utilizing state-of-the-art equipment to produce, package, and distribute food and beverages enjoyed around the world. Get a large soy latte, extra foam. Thank you. Did you ever wonder when you're at your local coffee shop enjoying a large soy latte, just where does all that soy milk come from? In Jacksonville, Dean Foods produces the best selling soy milk in the United States at its White Wave Foods division. A food, beverage, or pharmaceutical facility like this one can offer several types of careers. Our basic position here is to control all the manufacturing as far as the shipping of uh, different products that we produce here, such as uh, mainly soy milk and some white milk products. It actually gives me a sense of pride to know that I produce something that is in the store that others are able to see. You know, I actually go into the stores now and I may see my product and uh, just out of habit, I may straighten up a shelf or something just because it was something that came from my plant. In addition to soy milk, Florida manufacturers are responsible for all kinds of foods, beverages, and pharmaceutical products. Signature Brands in Ocala makes dessert sprinkles, gels, and cake decorations. Nature's Products in South Florida manufactures vitamins and nutritional supplements. 
and Florida's Natural Growers is a juice processing co-op in Lake Wales. We probably hire about 100 people a year, and those would range in skills from an entry-level operator all the way up to a very highly skilled me mechanic or electrician or electronics technician. I had always been interested in industrial chemistry because um, my father's actually uh, an industrial chemist, has a degree in chemical engineering. So uh, right from high school, and when I when I come home summer vacation, I, my um, summer vacation job will be working in a manufacturing environment. So I actually work in a cement factory. Running and maintaining equipment at a food, beverage, or pharmaceutical manufacturer can equip you with marketable skills like using programmable logic controllers, also known as PLCs. Anytime we want to do a modification or line change, we have to go in and maybe adjust the PLC program or the operator interface, the HMI, to, uh, to reflect those changes or to, for them to control the line. It's basically a, a software package that operates uh, hardware that takes the place of a lot of relays, timers. So next time you're enjoying your favorite food, beverage, or health product, remember that it's not just these great products that are made in Florida, but there are some terrific careers being launched here as well. Those are just a few of the many products coming out of Florida's fertile manufacturing industry. Here are some others. Medical devices and instruments. A hospital emergency. Critical surgery. State-of-the-art medical devices and instruments. Every day throughout Florida, there are people hard at work making products that save lives and enhance the public's health. These manufacturing facilities make medical devices and instruments that are used by hospitals, health professionals, and patients themselves. The people at Walter Lorenz Surgical manufacture metal plates and titanium screws that are used in critical surgeries. Seeing a product go from a uh, quarter inch bar stock to a uh, finish through and then being able there and, and getting that part perfect. So when the doctor gets it, it works and maybe helps some little kid's life. Over here we make our plating and what we do with our plates, primarily they use for the skull, sometimes the jaw. Um, it starts out as a raw piece of material, loaded in a machine with a program, it comes out as this. Actually, I got started in this through a temp service. I came in and I deburred the screws and I had a large interest in wanting to run the machines. I really didn't want to do anything but run the machine. In DeLand, Dot Decimal makes filters for radiation treatment of cancer. And then you'll notice when I hit the go button here, it's gonna grab this touch probe and it's gonna come over and measure it, the part. These high school students are touring Dot Decimal's manufacturing facility. And here are titanium dental implants and the material they were made from at the manufacturing company 3i in Palm Beach Gardens. Each day we learn more and more and more. It's a it's a it's a war inside on this company. Hundreds of medical manufacturers are making devices and instruments that are improving millions of people's lives every day. So you've started thinking about working in manufacturing. But how do you get there from here? There are several different pathways for entering the manufacturing industry. In high school, focus on math, science, and drafting. Go to technical school and learn a skill like welding, mechanical drawing, or metalworking. Enroll in community college to study computer-integrated manufacturing 
automation and controls, quality or advanced manufacturing, or go beyond. There are also opportunities for people with a bachelor's or advanced degrees. Metals and plastics fabrication. Well, Florida may not be the home of rock and roll, but Sarasota is the home of the metal guitar string. Black Diamond Strings has been manufacturing guitar strings since 1898. Metal strings are precision manufactured by employees using different types of fine wire. One of the owners of Black Diamond, Jim Cavanaugh, describes how guitar strings are made. The process is a winding process. You start with the core, it could be a synthetic core, it could be a metal core, uh, what we call a high carbon steel core, and then it's wrapped with different alloys. And the different alloys could be nickel. Uh, nickel would be great for uh, electric guitars. Um, a phosphor bronze wound guitar string would be great for acoustic guitar, and so forth like that. People have used their strings from the way back. B.B. King have used their strings in the past. Uh, Jimi Hendrix have used our strings in the past too, things like that nature. Just like precision is needed to make guitar strings, precision skills are required in most metals and plastics fabrication. Employees at metals and plastics fabrication firms can learn skills they can apply anywhere in the country. There's a lot of job opportunities. If you, if you have laser experience, there's these things are becoming a, a big commodity. Tampa Armature Works invests in plasma cutters and robotic welders. It's a faster weld. It's, it's obviously a more uniform weld. It, it, it's a better looking weld. Yeah, the, the welding industry just hit a home run with, with robotics. Uh, you, you can't beat it. At Metal Essence in Sanford, competing with global manufacturers is an everyday reality. They design, produce, and supply precision metal and plastic parts for other manufacturers in many different industries. Here, Al Stimak describes one of the company's manufacturing processes to a touring high school group. And what we do is we call a clean cut. We run a liquid nitrogen at minus 260 degrees right next to the uh, beam, so it, it, the beam melts the metal, we cool the bottom more, so that's what comes out so nice and clean like. In addition to the state's many custom machine shops, Florida also has large metal fabricators. We pretty much, we make every part that goes out of the, that goes into every assembled part. Uh, we run big 500 ton, 300 ton, 400 ton coil presses. It's, challenging and it's very satisfying. Whether it's small intricate parts or large components, high skills and high precision enable these parts to be made in Florida. Electronics and technical instruments. When a Category 5 hurricane strikes, devastation is inevitable and a huge recovery effort is required. From the electronics and technical instruments sector, Florida firms are prepared to do their part. After Hurricane Katrina hit the Gulf Coast, CrossMatch Technologies from Palm Beach Gardens contributed their biometric identification products to help identify victims, residents, and workers. And CrossMatch is only one of hundreds of electronics and instruments companies in Florida. Universal Microwave in Odessa makes electronic components for the communications industry. Your digital and wireless world wouldn't be possible without manufacturers like this. Universal Microwave, we manufacture uh, voltage controlled oscillators for the wireless communications industry. Like many manufacturers in Florida, Universal Microwave doesn't make the finished product that you may recognize, 
but it does manufacture critical parts and components. In St. Cloud, Mercury Marine follows this model by manufacturing components for their line of high-performance outboard motors. They are now making critical parts in Florida to solve problems caused from faulty parts that had been previously manufactured overseas. We had these switches. They're being built offshore. And we're having failures. And the, the switches that they were using weren't weren't to spec, weren't to print, they, they weren't made right, so we don't have that problem now. We're, we got good switches, we got them designed right, we're making them here. Datamax in Orlando designs, manufactures, and markets barcode printing products used worldwide. Rather than just designing them and seeing them on the computer, seeing a model, a 3D model on the, on the uh, computer monitor, you actually then very quickly we'll see those models turn into a real product. Florida companies are using cutting edge technology to make the electronic devices and components that make much of our modern society possible. Although we've only looked at four different product sectors, remember that Florida companies offer many jobs in many different sectors of manufacturing. We've got to change the, the perception that manufacturing is, is a dirty job, is a dead-end job, because it's not. And, and it's a clean environment. It's not the old days where it's a foundry, a steel foundry. What I like best about my job is the challenges. Everything's always changing, um, and we're, we're always challenging the system, looking for ways to improve everything. We've taken a look at a sampling of the different manufacturing facilities throughout Florida. Look around. You'll find that there are many opportunities in manufacturing available right now for all different types of people at all skill levels, right here in your community. Uh, you're not only helping yourself because you have a job, but you're also helping other people uh, increase their quality of life. Working here is, is, this is my second time around here. I left and I had to come back and because uh, it is such a good place to work. Um, I really like being on the edge of my seat. In Florida, the average manufacturing salary is $47,500. You know, it makes you feel good about yourself helping somebody out that's in pretty bad shape. And I'm very young, and I'm making a whole lot of money, you know? Yeah. We're expanding. We have new positions that are, you know, opening up daily. So uh, we're definitely looking for new, new qualified people. I'm just proud. Really, just, just a very, very high sense of pride to know that I did something that others get to see. If you want the pride of seeing your product in the store, Get excited about working with new technology or think you may excel within a team environment, then Florida's manufacturing industry may be the right place for you. Not, not, not like something wrong with working at a fast food joint, but it pay a whole lot more than a fast food joint. It's a good feel. Uh, you can make a lot of money doing this. A lot of money. Best thing I've done. I love it. <laughs> I love it.